Hi everyone, sorry for the bad lighting. Um, this is the thing, it's better. So, technically, right now, I'm a tripod. So, technically, right now, I'm meant to be in a lecture. Um, but I woke up and I didn't really feel up to going because of like, I was really tired. The past like 36 hours have been very eventful. Um, Luckily not so much for me, but for some friends, and I thought I would take a mental health day because I don't want to get burnt out too much. I can feel like getting burnt out already, and I mean I think I'm just permanently burnt out now, but I wanted to do a mental health day, um, so I'm not going to lectures. I am meant to be meeting a friend. Uh, at 12 it's currently nearly 10 it's just gone past 10 o'clock so yeah I'm going to start getting ready and then I'm gonna get ready to meet them and basically today is just gonna be a really chill vlog I was meant to film a different video um but it was like an evening routine video and I'm not gonna lie I've not had a evening routine um at all I need to get on that but yeah I'm going to go shower and get ready and then I'm gonna get dressed I'm got a cute outfit for today because I thought I'd make myself feel a bit better by not wearing um insanely baggy clothes um obviously if I end up wanting to be like if I end up like feeling like oh I want to wear comfy clothes after my shower then I will let myself do that basically today is just going to be like doing what I want and relaxing with my friends um and try and get into a good state better mental state than I am in currently but yeah I'm gonna go show we're all dressed um this is the outfit um I'm just chilling right now um I might be meeting a friend for to get boba tea I don't know if that's happening still because I'm not feeling too great um but um if if that is happening I'm gonna go to Boba and then everyone of my all my like flatmates and our next door neighbours are gonna be going shopping in town and enjoying ourselves and having fun today's gonna be a good day <laughs> I'm here with Katie right now. We're going to a vintage thing at uni, aren't we? Yes. Yes, vintage clothing. Most of it probably won't fit me, but some of it might fit you. Uh, but I'm gonna go meet friends and then go shopping. My necklace is there. Do I look good? Yes, weird. I didn't have glasses <laughs> yeah. as well. This is weird. I've got, wait, I'll just take my other earrings out as well. What's your clothes on your feet? We need Vaseline. Oh. You know how, like, I was saying, look weird without their piercings? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, uh, Naomi, uh, was putting the dye in my head we've currently clean filmed and I'm currently waiting for it to develop. Uh, I am on my own at the moment because uh, Jan and Naomi are just chilling in Jan's room and then uh, both Evie and Abby have gone to um, take their stuff out. Um, we still got uh, Abby's hair to dye because Abby used a colour stripper beforehand. So now, oh there's Jan, say hi! Hi! <laughs> um, I'm not alone anymore. I feel awkward filming now. Um, <laughs> but no, so yeah, that's what we're we doing. And then we've got to still dye Abby's hair. <laughs> la 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 la! Fabricast. 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 Um, can you please? Well, it's like, um, see. 
Also, I find this menu quite confusing. Are you filming this? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I find the menu really confusing, but sometimes I press the hits and I still get it wrong. <laughs> okay, so what this is saying, so uh -huh. technically, please, is sethnic. Okay. So kirni is like the verb version of asking for something. So short sethnic kirni means a beer, please, I'm asking. Literally. Oh, okay. Right, so there's like... Please, like, the noun, as in something that makes a person happy, and then there's please, like, the verb, of, as in please can I have. Yes. Oh, that makes sense. See, this is the things that it doesn't explain. The bear looks really disappointed to me. <laughs> Look at his face. He's like, you're going to get this wrong. <laughs> so, say that me, because I would like. Okay. Say that me. And then, so her colour is on, uh, you can't really see it with this lighting and if you were confused by what was happening in the last clip, um, basically uh, me and my friends were all, we all have Duolingo and we're all trying to like learn other languages, so I'm trying to learn German. Um, hello. My pronunciation is really bad. I do apologize um, if for some reason there's... I don't think I have pe any people who are watching who are from Germany. Um, but if you know German or... <laughs> I'm really sorry for the bad pronunciation. Um, but yeah, so hello. Um, ich bin Sophie. <laughs> Basically, I'm doing German. So... Uh, and so Naomi, who's... Uh, you s saw in the clip uh, the one who was learning uh, is trying to learn Hungarian and basically was getting really confused because in the words of Evie who was trying to help her because Evie is Hungarian um, that's her first language um, like even Evie's like Hungarian is very confusing um, but yes we're all trying to do that um, basically I thought what I'd do is I'd give you a little haul um, of what I bought today. Um, it's in like three different bags and stuff. Um, obviously bought the hair dye. Um, it's the Schwarzkopf, um, like, kind, and I use the shade Ultraviolet. Um, then, so I also got some cotton pads because I use those for, um, putting on my, I don't think there's anything else in here apart from the receipt. Um, but I use that to put on my micellar water, um, yeah, and then there should be some clothes, there is clothes in here, um, I got this, so basically there was like a little vintage shop thing today, um, that's where I got this lovely tote bag from, uh, it's just this thrift on it in different colours, repeated, um, and so I got the bag and then I got these shorts from H&M which look really cool and they're called like paper bag and I really like the idea of them because um like they they seem like they'll be really comfy and not tight around my waist which is something I is a sensation I don't really enjoy um as most people don't and then so this is the shirt that I got from the sale and it's this really cool NASA shirt so I was just I was like the amount of like outfits like I could put pair this with like jeans, the shorts like I can do like pretty much anything. And then finally, I've been needing some like smart trousers because I have like one pair um, now. I used to have a couple more, but they don't fit anymore. Or they, well, they ripped. <laughs> Basically, my smart black pair uh, ripped. But this is pair of as well and these are from Primark and they were only four pound which I think is like ridiculously good um I am trying to reduce the amount of clothes I buy um just because like it is I don't need any more clothes like realistically I don't um but yes yeah, so that was clothes and then most of the stuff's in here um, I had to buy a few essential things. Oh, actually, we're not done with clothes yet. Um, 
do have some other things. So I bought these like socks, which are like grippy socks, um, like ones that have like grips on the bottom, so you can wear them and stuff. And they're cozy socks, and they're all star themed, so that's cool. Um, and then I also bought some plain black socks because I'm needing some plain black socks. And these are have reinforced heel and toe, which is good because I like to wear my good old thick boots. Um, and then I got some earrings. Um, there's a shop called Louisa in the uh, one of the shopping centres where we are. I'm really sorry. Here we go. Uh, and basically they had a deal on where it was 5 for 10. And so I basically got 5 earrings. So this was the first set that I got. Don't know how well you can see. Don't focus on me. Um, but these, so these are some black roses. Um, and this is a really cute one. They got like little elephants. I don't know how well you can see them, but like the little elephants. Um, and then all of these ones are like themed kind of similarly. So I got these three stars. I wanted a set of these sorts of earrings for years. Um, and when I eventually get my seconds done, um, I do actually have my ears fits. I just didn't wear a lot of earrings because in my job, I'm not allowed to wear jewelry. Um, but hopefully in my new job, I, I can wear jewelry um, and stuff. Um, but I was thinking like, how cute would it be like to have the stars on like my seconds and then have like the mo these hoopy moons um on the second um and then got some more moons i was mainly trying to find like small kind of more study types of jewelry because i've been getting a lot of like dangly jewelry um but i don't have a lot of like more like creative studs um but yeah next, the rest of the stuff is kind of like skincare stuff so I have this cream because basically I've had a flare up of my psoriasis. It's a very small one, so I only got a small little thing. And basically, they I talked to the pharmacist and they recommended this. I didn't want a steroid cream, um, just because it wasn't. It's not that bad of a breakout. Um, but basically, I got this moisturizer thing, small one, um, and then oh, then I got some new Carmex. Uh, I haven't run out of my other one yet, but I'm buying that preemptively so I'm not like having a break between stuff. Um, receipts are in there. Um, so then I got some skincare stuff that I was running out of, or slash have run out of. Um, but so I'd run out of my niacinamide serum, which is why I think partially why my skin's kind of breaking out and also because I like um dermaflayed it a few days ago um and I think I was a bit too close to the skin so I think my skin's reaction to that um but yeah so I've got my niacinamide serum I think that's how you pronounce it niacinamide serum I always get really confused by these pronunciation things like I don't get it but <laughs> tis I um, and then I got the vitamin B, C, and E moisturizer, um, which is apparently good for oily skin and it keeps the skin healthy. I found that, um, I bought this when I started using the hyaluronic acid serum. Uh, I, I've since stopped using the hyaluronic serum when it ran out because I, I did like, I liked some parts of the way it made my skin feel, but then also sometimes it's like, I didn't like it. Um, and also I feel like this moisturizer does actually moisturize my skin and makes my skin feel better. Um, and yeah. And then finally I got the C50 Blemish Night Treatment, which I use, um, which I like using in the evening because it's like I can just wash my face, put like my micellar water on and then like my serum, like, and then this. And then I can just put this on and then I don't have to do anything else. Like... Like, at some some points this week, I've literally just done cleanser and this because, um, so technically this is the last, this is a treatment, but you are only meant to, like, it's meant to be. So, whereas, like, normally, it, according to this, you'd clean, hydrate, treat, um, and then moisturise, and then in the morning, SPF. 
Um, this is in the treatment side, but you only use it. You use it at night because obviously it's a exfoliating thing. I think it's an intensive treatment and it involves like vitamin C ish. Yeah, vitamin C and vitamin E, which you don't want to use really during the day because it makes sure it can make your skin more sensitive to the sun. Um, and we don't really want that. And it does specifically say night treatment. Um, but yeah, anyway, that was the haul for today. The little haul for this bit. Um, so went shopping, as I said, dyed my hair, which I'm really happy with. Um, I like how kind of like you can't really tell, but then like if you look closer, you can tell. And also if you're wondering why my hair is so voluminous, it's because I like uh, I used a hairdryer. Um, I have a lot of hair and yeah um my skin it feels a lot better than it did. my skin my, my skin my hair hates it hates being air dried i do use like heat protectant on it um but always when it's first dried it's a bit like doesn't like it it doesn't but that's fine um it's not used to it um because i don't really like to use heat on my hair i have been using it a bit more now um, but yeah, so in, but yeah, also before I go, I have got these care conditioners uh, from the hair. So I'm going to be using this the next couple of times I wash my hair. Um, and yeah, so that's the end of this section of the video. Boy. So I didn't actually film any more of that video. Um, also, it has been a while since that video was actually filmed. That video was filmed in February yeah February um and what is that oh no um and it is currently uh, nearly the end of March so it's taken me a while to get this video up um there was no videos in March and for that I do apologize um it's just been a very hectic thing this semester has just been very busy um but as you would have seen last week there was a bit uh, oh no so uh, there should be some more videos coming out this month because I have already filmed one, another one, and there are more planning on coming. Um, I'm nearly at my Easter holidays, so I'm just holding out <laughs> um, and then I'll be able to film some videos while I'm at home for Easter. Um, but yeah, so that's the vlog. Um, if you enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment down below and subscribe and I will see you all next week with another video. Bye!